Midland. It's Chris and Grant here for What's Up with the City Planning Edition. We're going to chat about the most recent planning commission meeting, which happened on July 13th, 2021. How you doing, Grant? Hey, doing well, Chris. So, Grant, there are a few things on the agenda. Um, let's talk about the conditional use permit that uh, ended up being number 73 in Big B Coffee. Give sure. me an overview. Yeah, so this is a, a proposal for a brand new drive through coffee house um, and a sit-in coffee house. Um, out on Eastman Avenue, where the current um, or former T-Mobile location was at and previously a chemical bank. Um, so this is just north of Airport Road and on the west side uh, between Old Chicago and Panera Bread. So Grant, we know that uh, Eastman is got a lot of traffic on it, uh, Eastman Avenue. Uh, yeah. Were there any traffic concerns with this new uh, conditional use permit? So in short, there was a discussion related to that at Planning Commission, and that's something also that city staff paid particular attention to. Like you said, Eastman does have a lot of vehicles on it. Uh, recently, the city just went through and expanded that portion of Eastman, adding some additional lanes to the southbound um, side of things. And as part of the review that the staff did and the questions that Planning Commission also asked to vet it even more, um, we did find that there will be an additional about 200 vehicles that will access this part of Eastman than what um, is happening currently throughout an average day. Of course, with the majority of those, um, or the peak, highest peak being when people get coffee in the morning. Um, but in review of that and consideration of the capacity of Eastman Avenue, staff has not identified any uh, large concerns and traffic should still flow uh, well through that area like it does right now. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, next little bit on the agenda was a Midland City Modern update. Can you give me a one there? I can. So um, we do have a couple of things coming up with the City Modern master planning process. Um, and of course, anyone can find out this information at MidlandCityModern.com. But we do have a neighborhood and livability survey that's out on East City Hall. And then also next week, Thursday, that's July 22nd, um, we will be doing our second Midland Moves event, which will be a walking tour around Plymouth Park. So we'll encourage members of the community to come out. That starts at 5.30 p.m. And we'll probably go till about 6.30 p.m. Uh, with the walk itself being just over a half mile. Cool. Well, I filled out my survey. Didn't take that long. So I encourage everybody else to do that. Um, Grant, yeah. thank you so much for joining as always. Hey, thanks for having me. Hey, and as always, you can catch our meetings live on MGTV, Cable Channel Charter 188, and Cable Channel U-verse 99. You can also head to our city website, cityofmidlandmi.gov, to watch them on demand. And if you have an Apple or Roku TV, you can watch them at the MCTV Network. That's all you have to do. Search for MCTV Network. And as always, Midland, we thank you for watching, and we'll catch you all later.